Hey fam and welcome back to I Love Me Me Me. So for those of you who are finding my channel for the very first time, my name is Marshawn and I'm your life and relationship strategist. I help men and women alike to create the relationship that they want, need, and deserve. So today we're going to be talking about three essential reasons why you must heal before you can find love. Stay tuned. All right, fam, thanks so much for coming back. So before I get into the three reasons why it's essential for you to heal in order to find love, I want to ask you guys out there to help your girl out. So I have different things that I am currently working on or that I'm thinking about working on, and I have a survey. So for those of you out there who are interested in helping your girl out, please see my email link down below and um, send me an email either on my I love me me 123 at gmail or my Marshawn at MarshawnOlanio.com. Either email is fine and just put in the subtopic um, excuse me, put in the subject area, send me the survey. I need you guys help. That way I can know what I should be working on. What is it that you guys want? Okay, so now the three reasons why it's essential for you to heal before you can find love. Let's go ahead and talk about it right now. The first reason is very simple, really simple, which is you not only hurting yourself, by putting yourself through all of these emotional states each and every time that you jump from one relationship to the next because you have not healed and dealt with your baggage. You're also hurting the other person as well because maybe they are ready to get into a relationship, but being that they're dealing with you who is not ready to get into a relationship, now you're taking them down through an emotional roller coaster that they shouldn't be on with you. And so from all of the emotional scars that you had previously, that tissue is just getting thicker and thicker and thicker. And it's going to take a longer period of time each time you jump from relationship to relationship without healing. That scar tissue is going to get thicker and thicker and thicker, making it that much harder and taking that much longer to break down. Okay. The second reason why healing is essential to find a love is because if not, you're going to just be comfortable and doing just enough to get by. Just enough to stay safe. Just enough to pave the road to say, you know what, this is a pretty decent life. This is a good life. But it won't be the road to this is a great life. I am absolutely excited about the life that I am building. It won't be that road. When you have not healed before you find love, before you jump into the next relationship. So it's essential that you must heal before doing all of that. The third and final reason, my friends, is because the answer is internal. It's never external. So every single time you jump from relationship to relationship and you have not healed yourself, you have not dealt with your baggage, you have not looked within to see what you, yes, you, what you were doing wrong, what offenses you did within the relationship on why it didn't work out. Were you constantly blaming? Were you constantly shaming? Were you constantly nagging? Were you constantly trying to be controlling? What is it that you were particularly doing? Was that insecurity showing up at every step of the way? What were you doing? What were you doing to cause the relationship not to flourish? Again, those answers are internally, they're never externally, and we have a tendency to want to blame the other person or just other people for the life that we are creating ourselves each and every day. And you can't do that. You have to understand that you have the power to create the life as well as the love life, as well as your career, as well as any other type of relationship that you'll be a part of. You're creating it, every single one of them. So now I'm going to ask you, what are you going to do to create the life, the love life, the career life, every type of relationship that you want? What are you going to do to create that life? How are you going to start showing up? How are you going to deal with that baggage? How are you going to heal before jumping into the next relationship? Think about it. Deuces.